what inspires your music more, being happy in love or like heartbreak? <sighs> I think they're both they're both great great subjects to talk about because they're very like strong emotions. Whether you're happy or you're really sad, they're both like really like. It, it takes a lot to be happy and it takes a lot to be sad. Mm -hmm. So you just have to, you know, write different things, how you're feeling and totally. either way. Which one's more rewarding, like after the fact, you know? Like, yeah. I, I mean, I'd rather be happy than yeah. sad. <laughs> I feel like, so. well, I mean, like, I feel like <laughs> hanging out with the song, like it feels good to get it out and it's kind of therapeutic. Ironically, like I feel like once you write a really happy song about a relationship, like one day you're cleaning out your computer after you guys broke up and all of a sudden it comes on, you're like, you start crying and it turns into the sad song. Aww. Well, that's, that's what I think the cool thing about music is, is that if you're really in love, you can write a song about that, and and then if someone else hears it that relates to the situation, then they feel that same emotion too. So yeah. that's something about no, writing music cool. that I think is really fun that it's other people very... can relate to it. I think heartbreak is funny that way though because you think that it's going to be such a great creative stimulus for you when you sit down and you write, but you actually are so debilitated you can't even write about it because you're so upset. That was powerful. But sometimes that your was heartbreak really can powerful. like help someone else Absolutely. going through their heartbreak. It's mm. true. So oh heartbreak. We could just change it and up. And we're young. And Let's write a song right now about heartbreak. <laughs> and a one, and a two, and a three.